Oh, I got actually. I forgot I moved that over. Test, test, test. All right, that looks good. It's all looking good, I hope. Boom. Boom, that's good. All right, I think we're good all around. All kinds of good. All right, so. I haven't streamed in like a week or so. I've, if you if you notice, I got a new lo new logo down there. Uh, where where would it be? Uh, be? That direction. So like over there, you can kind of see it. I also set some gates on my microphone so that it shouldn't pick up like my air conditioning and different I mean, shit like that. Anyway, I'm just saying it should be improved. Even though, you know, I, I think it was okay before. Now it should be even better. But let me know if there's any problems. Anyway. What are we doing here? Uh, there was a Nintendo Indie World, like, uh, about an hour ago. I didn't get a chance to see it live, and I've avoided all spoilers. I haven't seen anything yet, which is exactly what I want. Um, so here we go. Now we shall watch it. I'm hoping for Sports Story. I know a lot of people are hoping for Silk Song. I don't think they, that would be in one of these. I think Hollow Knight has ascended to a level where it would be in a proper big Nintendo Direct. God, it's hot in this room. I turned my air conditioning down. I might knock it down a degree or more. Hang on. Let's see how that goes. I also got a new button half set up, but then when I set up the logo, it kind of fucked it up. It also fucked up the Reggie button, so I'm going to have to fix those before I hit them. You know what? Nah, no, I'm not, not going to hit them now. Um, anyway, here we go. Oh, wait. I have no audio. Why is that? You guys have audio, I think, but I do not. Huh. No way it should go that way. Uh oh. Well, that's going to really suck. Let me try. Let me try a few things. Bear with me. Sorry about this, folks. It's always something. Oh, I'm gonna lose my place in that video, aren't I? Oh. 
Uh, I might have to reboot my Xbox. I mean, what I could just do, honestly, I could stream without headphones and just play my auto through my TV. I'd, if I, I don't think it'll come through in the microphone because I because of the gates I just set up. Luckily. Damn it. Yeah, that's all do. No, oh, pause the video. Oh, that's a bummer, but oh well. Um, play for a second and see if it sets off my microphone. Hang on. It is a little quieter. Yeah, that seems to be okay. The mic isn't picking up the TV. It's a little quiet for me, but I'll live. Hello, and welcome to Indie World. I'm Ariko, and I'm Amber. We're back. Uh, this is Ooblets. This has been on Xbox for a while. Uh, Lisa loves this game. The globe. And it's still in early Australia, access, so maybe it's hitting 1.0 and it's and going to come to Switch at the same time. What they've been cooking up. So let's get started. I'll play it on Xbox because I already bought it. That's cool. It's such just fun to say. I do love games that are cozy and weird. I hope this runs oh, well on Switch. I've been this not playing my Switch very much after getting the Series X and the PS5, especially the Series X, because even though I did buy the OLED, it's just adorable little creatures called ooblets. can't stand 30 frames a second anymore, and in some games even struggle to hit that. Customize your character, befriend the locals, decorate your house, run your own shop. And most importantly, have epic dance battles. I would assume that means it's going to be hitting 1.0 this summer, because like I said, it's in early access now. Locations. Visit the Arcade Pack Boardwalk in Port Forward. Saunter through the spooky swamps of nowhere. And ascend the frozen peaks of Tippy Top. a little more audio, Top. though? Ooblets waddles its way onto Nintendo yes. Switch this summer. Yeah, look, looks like the mic's still not Colorful and mesmerizing Good. planets await in this fast-paced action RPG across the cosmos. I hope not, anyway. In this deeply story-driven game by Stormind Games, you'll use both strength and wits to interact with others and conquer the challenges ahead. Balancing the duality of your physical and mental powers is key. Sacrifice one for the Team other 17. against the and... Publisher of Worms and a bunch of other well stuff. For you. Ultimately, your conscience will carry the weight of your decision. Oh my god, I feel like I've heard of this. What kind of hero will you become? Are you a light bulb in this Choose game? Your destiny in or am I thinking of something else? Or did I make that up? I might have made that up. This fall. エルケッドは私が学生時代の頃流れるというテーマのコンテスト向けに好きなゲームからインスピレーションを受けて開発したプロトタイプ先になります。いやあ、I um, accountable to actually play more stuff. 
And I've worked for a big Pokemon that I didn't play at all last week. I played a ton of Destiny, though, last week and just didn't stream it because... I tried to, but I was having trouble getting... I was playing with Lisa, and I wanted the audio for her to come in, too. And it, and it was, but it was delayed. It was, it was a big old mess. Um, I got... I ordered a... Something, though, that my, that I sure hope is gonna help with that. And then we can stream some multiplayer games together. That's the plan, anyway, and if it doesn't work, then I don't know how the hell I'm gonna make it work. Hey! If you're looking for a clever and challenging 2D puzzle platformer, then we've got just the game for you from Nama Takahashi, a one-person development team. Here, you're a small robot Oh, I guess also... Delight. Who's on I got a haircut to since you guys left, so I didn't even world, think about that. ...while navigating a booby-trapped facility. By using your electrifying powers to touch walls, floors, platforms, and switches, electricity will charge through them and bring them to life. I guess so. Hey, don't get ahead of I yourself. I my arm up like that. I guess it doesn't I mean, look actually, good. You should. My back is killing Detach me. Detach and throw your head to, to trigger out. objects. You'll need I to apologize. retrieve it within 10 seconds. Noodle else. cake. There are plenty of hidden rooms and secrets to discover, so use your head, literally, to explore the every thing on the bottom almost looks like the uh, the Curse of the, the Necro Dancer. Song to Nintendo Switch you get to the beat, fight to the beat. This isn't a Necro Dancer sequel, is it? It's totally different art style, and and you're not like moving and steps like that. She's moving freely, so I don't think it is. Co-op. I hope it's multi. Or I hope it's online. Uh, big problem with indie games is so many of them have co-op, but they're local only. So many miss online co-op. That sucks for my stories. The soundfall. I think this was in the pre-show of the game awards. I think. Let's say yes. Of games combines Online, all right. Well, now I'm much more interested in this game. That'll keep you on your toes and tapping your toes. As a I will definitely play this then. You're transported to the world of Symphonia to battle the forces of Discord. You know, another thing I always wonder when I watch these indie worlds, which of these games will be day one on Game Pass, because obviously they're not going to sell us on a Nintendo show, but it happens a lot. Well, uh, like, I'll probably go on Twitter after this and find out, hey, this, and there are these over two or three games are going to be day one on Game Pass. From. So pick the tune you want to hear before jumping into the fray. Time your actions. Oh, that's today? And your power Hell yeah. Increase. There are five different. Lisa, we got to play Soundfall. To choose from. Of course, we got a lot of Destiny to do. We got a lot of stuff to do. And thousands of loot combinations, giving you opportunities for more. Chucklefish makes good stuff. Get your head bopping to Soundfall, launching on the Nintendo Switch no, system fish, the later publisher. today. <sighs> Why is it freezing in here? You better be ready to weather the snowstorm in Wild Frost. Take on the harsh elements in this rope-like deck builder from Dead Pangoon. King Games. Moko? I like Pangoon. Build and customize your deck as you Pen set off to yeah, put Pengoon. an end to the Eternal Pen Pen Frost. Pen Card companions and items are at your disposal. Did I say the Use same thing twice? It felt like after wave of monsters same pen and penguin, penguin, penguin. Mm. brutal bosses. Plan I'll just do this the rest of the stream, guys. I'll just make sounds. Fell those frosty fiends. After each run, try daily challenges or expand the hub town of Snowdwell to unlock new events and cards. Helpful for your fight against the perpetual winter. Wild Speaking Fox, of, this is on Game Pass and was on, on it's, it's been on there for a while. And I think this has been Here out of early access. I know it was, it was definitely, it was in early access when it first came to Game Pass. I think it's already out of early access. We are excited to I think it's a, it's a real boy game now. Battle Simulator, or TAPS for short, will be coming to Nintendo Switch. 
I don't mean a boy game, I mean, he's a real boy. His minions hit 1.0. This game, I, I still have There's another one I haven't played, but I've seen videos on the shit. And it's hysterical. You can make... Put in things like, I want to see T-Rex fight sumo wrestler or whatever. <laughs> just Or a hundred sumo wrestlers, I guess it would be more fair. And you just, I don't know, I think you more... You watch these things happen. You you put in the scenarios and watch them happen more than actually like. I don't even know what you do to play the game, but it's funny to watch. That should probably be today too. That makes sense because this is an old game. So bad. Do the wobble wobble. Wait, what? You heard that right. In this fighting game from Landfall Games, you'll lead teams of over 100 wobblers Should be in battle, in gardens. hailing from Except for ancient Pinata. lands, spooky worlds, and fantasy realms. Those wobbly physics are uh, very uh, wobbly. Oh, they're awesome. And those aren't your garden variety battles either. Watch your wobblers flail and fail in silly simulated battles. Or make new ones in the unit creator and customize their size, nope, weight, don't say it and with her. speed, among other stats. That is a bastardization of the thing's catchphrase and CM Punk's catchphrase. I don't like it. The wobble? Send them to fight your friends in online multiplayer mayhem. That's what we're about to. That's say the game of your cat in the back. wobbling time. You never cease to amaze me. Don't know I'm the best. Totally accurate battle simulator. Wobbles. I think we've seen this one before. On Nintendo Switch. Oh, wait, step. no, maybe not. That The other one I was thinking of is on a train the whole time. It's like a murder mystery. This one. Yeah, I don't know this one. I lied. I lied. Oh, yeah. Definitely haven't seen that before. It's an umbrella gun. Don't bring either of them to gym. Is that an option? Yeah, that's pretty simple, man. Devolver! Devolver has good, uh... Um... Curation. They usually pick good games to, uh, publish. Or at least interesting games. Not always great. You're a gruff woodsman on a quest for revenge in this noir punk action adventure from Doinksaw. Armed with the titular Gumbrella, you'll maneuver through various locations, from a cultish town to a junkyard fortress. Use the Gumbrella to glide. Is swim, Death Door on dash, Switch yet? Dive, Maybe that's like something enemies, they would announce here. Side scrolling combat. Along the way, you'll scavenge for scraps and spare parts to upgrade. I was thinking about tunic, but it's probably too and soon for that. Employ your oh, sleuthing skills to assist a cast of increasingly bizarre characters in a world rapidly losing. Team OFK, its this is that resources. episodic that's music just game. The beginning of your investigation. Plenty of dark twists and turns lie ahead. Gumbrella launches on Nintendo Switch next year. Hey everyone, I'm Jared Huntley, lead programmer on We Are OFK. And I'm Luca LaFay, lead singer of the band OFK. We're super excited to announce that our music biopic game yeah, is episodic. coming to oh, Nintendo Switch. Oh, it's weekly Switch. episodic? Yes. That's pretty crazy. Ooh, I can play it on a tour bus. Ugh, I can't How many episodes is it going to be then? We haven't seen each other since that music video brainstorm at your place in LA in 2019? Yeah, wow, wow. And with the game on handheld, it'll be easy to play the new episodes that are coming out every single week, <laughs> back to back to back. Can't wait to share OFK's story and music with y'all. Hey, Jared, can I get your opinion on tour outfits? I want to say this was at the Game Awards like two years ago, when I first saw it. First heard of it. 
Maybe last year, but I think it was longer than that. I don't want an emotional ride. Those make me sad. It's gotta be near the end here. This musical narrative from indie pop band OFK is gonna take you on quite the emotional ride. Set in downtown Los Angeles, Itsumi Saito struggles to establish herself in LA's ruthless music scene while managing a full-time job a social weekly episodes is kind of crazy brutal commute but a chance encounter with a rising hollywood music producer may give her the edge she needs to achieve her dreams through episodes released weekly and interactive music videos with a fully voiced cast you'll witness the lives of itsumi and her friends unfold you're allowed to it's take summer. a break and not be okay for a second thank you from fighting over song lyrics at band practice to sending some memes via text. It's a heartfelt making of the band journey. Bristol! Sure to I know that sound. Heartstrings. We are OFK. Drums onto Nintendo Switch this summer. Hi, I'm Dom. And I'm Tom. And we're Spiral Circus. We are an indie games developer based in Bristol, UK. And our passion for the stranger and surreal side of art is what brought us together. We both come from really different backgrounds. I was a research scientist and Tom is a fine artist. Because of the pandemic, we've been an entirely remote team and almost all of Silt has been hand drawn at night by me, which seems entirely appropriate for the subject matter. Ooh. Our audio designer even set up a fish tank in his studio to record the underwater sounds that you'll be hearing throughout the game. We're really excited for you to experience our hand drawn work brought to ah. life. And we hope you enjoy exploring the strange oceanic world of Silt on Nintendo Switch. Take a deep breath and dive into the harrowing ocean abyss. In the depths of this you take over the secret from snake. Spiral Circus Games, you'll unravel long forgotten mysteries as you explore a surreal underwater realm filled Need with art strange style. machinery, ancient ruins, and dangerous ocean inhabitants. A unsettled. variety of like sea that. creatures can be possessed. I like to be settled. Harness their abilities to Do solve not unsettle puzzles, me. Navigate the haunting environment and survive encounters against the motorways. This is on Apple Arcade. It's There's supposed to be really good. Meets the eye in this unsettling monochrome world. Plunge I want to see more Apple Arcade games come over to Switch because I I don't have Nintendo Apple Arcade. Switch I have a trial for it that I need to do at some point. Um, because I love the idea of it. I just hey, haven't done it. But uh, especially Choo Choo Rocket, Rocket Universe. Morning commute that I'm dying real to, jam. to get. If you got my drift. Oh, I know, right? They already put but Grindstone what? over. In many motorways from developer Dinosaur Polo Club, the key to solving the city's congestion problems is you. Draw and build roads to create a bustling metropolis. It's too many challenges for me. And keep traffic flowing on maps inspired by real life cities. As demands interchange, you'll continuously redesign today too. Makes sense for an older game. upgrades like highways and roundabouts. Ramp up the difficulty by taking part in daily and weekly challenges. More maps will unlock as you become a master road designer. How long can you keep the cities of the world moving? Buckle up for mini motorways. Cruising onto Nintendo Switch. 1970s rural Australia with a flying hospital. Australia's Whoa, weird, man. Y'all fucked up down there. That's new. I've never seen that before. Then hop aboard this heartfelt narrative adventure from Ghost Pattern, set in 1970s. To fly rural from Australia. Australian city to Australian city, like Casey, London to, to know a diverse cast Blackpool, eclectic voiced characters or Manchester. The stories they tell and the moments you share. Each story unfolds in real time at the same time so you get to choose which ones you want to experience follow the all your favorite australian cities eavesdrop on them or enter the room and be part of the conversation right. darcy right mrs b's kid it's um casey 
Not, um, Casey. Just Casey. Sure. By keeping track of information in your notebook and spending time with certain characters, you might unearth new stories, Lots for June and July. locations, and revelations. Total land. This game has been looking real cool. Opportunity to witness other events, allowing you to delve weird, deeper sure. into the stories and weave together mysteries aboard the airship. Wayward Strand lands on Nintendo Switch July 21st. A randomly generated world. It's cool. I want to be a coal leader. I'm down with that. Massive monster. As a possessed lamb saved by a foreboding stranger from a ritual sacrifice, you need to repay your debt by creating a loyal community of woodland worshippers. Gather resources to build structures. Then gather your courage to brave deadly dungeons like the Silk Cradle. Venture through its dark depths, teeming with razor spiders and toxic millipedes to challenge the along. dungeon's Whoa. overlord Shimura. It's like game by Agra Crash. About it. I know what you got that name. Cult of the Lamb trots onto so Nintendo sick. Switch this year. What was their first game? Oh, I like that. Oh, boy. Oh, brother. All right, this is kind of cute. Does he not have a shell? Why does he have a can? Did somebody steal a shell? Oh. Crab's treasure. What was their first game? Was it that crab fighting game? Crab fans. Oh, going under. Going Under is a real good game. That I also haven't played, but it seems like a good game. Hey, I've seen some Crab of it, and, it's, and it looks really cool. Previously, Agro Crab released Going Under, and it didn't make us rich. So this time, we're selling out and giving the people what they want. Crabs. Our second project is a yeah, I don't like Soul Souls Likes, but another crab that one. Treasure. Through our extensive research, we found that crabs are the perfect enemy for an action game. They've got natural weapons, can strafe from side to side, and you can hit their weak point for massive damage. Souls likes are known for their difficulty, and we want to create yeah, a game that maintains I don't like Souls likes normally, but I'd approachable mm. for new fans of the genre. Ooh, I'll try this one if it's approachable. When you're not wearing a shell. I just said it's supposed Especially to be. Especially they put it on Game Pass, going under on Game Pass. Roll, so. There's like a 1% chance that you just trip and fall over. Well, it looks like our segment's it does over, everyone. It's, it's time for crab. All right, Eriko, put your pincers up. Oh, here we go with the crab puns. Crab. Oh, you can put different stuff as your shell. Anyway, in this action adventure from Agro Crab, you'll embark on an epic treasure yeah, hunt the, under the sea. That's what they're saying. Fifty percent shells. Shell. Wish I had those. Wading through this underwater world, plagued Can't by hear pollution them. and sinister secrets, you'll Maybe scavenge just shut for up trash off. and use it as a shell to defend yourself in challenging combat. There are over 50 potential shells, so get shellfish with them and repel enemies with powerful umami Sports story. Magic. If you don't, oh. you'll be in a pinch before That's right, they you know. do a montage and they act like that's the end, but it's never the end. One crab's trash is another crab's treasure, which sidesteps onto Nintendo Switch Card Shark was there. Year. I have Card Shark drafted in one of my Fantasy Critic Leagues. For our last segment, we'd like to show you a sneak peek of several more indie games coming to Nintendo Switch. Enjoy! <clears throat> Gibbon! Is that co-op? There's two Gibbons. Well, I hope that's co-op. Idol manager, that creeps me out. I love the game. A free demo today. This game's supposed to be very good. Card truck. You're 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 not you're cheating at cards. You're not playing them well. First golf look also looks very cool. You're not yeah you're not playing cards uh, straight in that game. You're you're trying to cheat. Guidebook of Babel.
don't know that one. Oh, I should probably turn off notifications when I do this. One more. I hope it's a sports story. That's all. Wait, they don't normally say the Twitter and stuff. This might we actually hope be you the end. Enjoyed the slew of games in today's showcase. No. A big thank you to our indie. It is. And indie partners. For That's crazy to end on a Nintendo montage. Switch. And as always, thank you for watching. Check out wow. our official Twitter kind of account to that, stay up to date there. on all the latest Indie World news. Wow. Well, Until next time. All right. Um, nothing was like a huge standout to me, but you know, Ooblets coming to Switch and assuming hitting 1.0 on Xbox. I'm a, that's my assumption anyway. That's cool. Um, a sound was it Soundfall? That, that one comes out today. Um, so that's neat too. Yeah, no, no huge standout there, but yeah, neat stuff. Um, the crab game. What was it called? I can't remember. The the developer was Agro Crab, but the game was. I forget. But that looks neat. Yeah, some neat stuff there. Nothing that really blew my socks off. I'm not wearing socks anyway, though. So, you know, they were already blown off. I'm going to bed. Goodbye.